What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Juizy. Now, it is Sunday, it is seven o'clock in the morning. I had a good night's sleep. I've been hustling so hard that my sleep was super deep, but I'm ready to hustle today. I'm ready to make it happen. I'm ready to make $150 like we did yesterday. My goal is to stay out and not have to go home and come back out for dinner my goal is to make 150 straight on from now until whatever time it takes me to complete the 150 dollars don't forget to smash that like button to help me blow up in the youtube world and if you like this video at the end just subscribe now let's get started all right ladies and gentlemen the time is 7 30 in the morning let's clock in for the day at 7 30 a.m i had logged in uber eats and doordash to start receiving orders while i was charging and uber eats loves to test our parameters Uber Eats loves to test our parameters because we accepted an order for $5, 1.7 miles. So they like to give us orders that are the bare minimum of, of our parameters, but let's accept it, $5, 1.7 miles. Let's go and let's make some money, guys. I love days like now. It's so quiet, there's no traffic. It's so quiet, guys, no traffic at all. This is how I look. I wish I could live alone in this world. Nah, I'm kidding. People are amazing. All right, let's go pick this up. Starbucks. Let's go pick it up. I know I don't have to put every single order back here, but I like putting it here because it looks professional in case the customer comes out of nowhere and, and sees me taking out the food. At least they know that. They'll know that it's secured in the back and I haven't messed with it or anything. You know, it just looks a little bit more professional. All right, this is the person's place. I just have to go in with the lobby, check in with the lobby, and go up to the 21st floor. Let's go. All right, guys, the time is 7.40 in the morning, and we just completed our $5 order for 1.7 miles. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the time is 7.50 in the morning, and we just accepted a $9.38 order going 4.7 miles. I love that order. It's 7.50. Let's go make $9, and let's go make some money, and let's go hustle. Let's go. We are here at Panera Bread. Let's go pick up the order. Let's go. All right, I got the order already. It's this coffee and this huge bag right here. I don't know if it's me or or maybe I think everybody, there's a lot of people that are could be hung over from Halloween parties because it seems dead. Like there's nobody in Panera Bread. There was nobody at Publix when I went inside uh, to go use the restroom. Um, but this the streets look dead right now. It seems like, like everybody's asleep. I don't know. All right, so I got the coffee there secured so it doesn't move. And this is the, the Panera Bread. All right, as I was about to start swipe delivery or start delivery, I got an additional order added on for $4.50 for an additional 2.6 miles. And I may regret it, but I took it. Let's go pick it up. I know where it is. It's pretty close. But the first drop off is super far away. So I don't know how that's going to work. Let's just go and pick it up quick. Our food is in a hot bag, so it's going to stay warm. All right, so I'm just gonna leave this here because it doesn't look like something that needs to stay warm. So the bread is not even warm. So let's just leave it like that and not get fancy with it. And let's go deliver these two orders. All right, the time is 8, 10 in the morning. We just dropped off the first order for $4.50. Let's drop off the second order. All right, the time is 8.20 in the morning and we just completed our second order of our double order batch uh, for $9.38. That order in total uh, paid us $14 if you round it off. All right, so the time is 8.39 in the morning and I just accepted an Instacart order for $9 for four items. Those are the Instacart orders I'm gonna do, the small little items that'll take me less than less than 30 minutes. So it's like 1.1 miles away. I was already here in Publix anyway, so let's get it. All right, so this order took me seven minutes, but the reason why it took me seven minutes is because it took me like three or four minutes to find this. And I knew it was an empty bottle, but I couldn't find it, but I finally got it and we are done. This is our $9 order, let's go pay. All right, this is our $9 order. That's it. I know it was only a few bags, but I didn't want to carry four two liter Cokes I want to try harder than I needed to, so I just got our little handy dandy wagon. 
Alright, we just completed our $9 Instacart order for 1.1 miles and while I was walking through the building, I turned on DoorDash and I was able to accept a $6 order for 3.4 miles so we could keep the ball rolling and make that money. Let's go. Alright, so the good thing about accepting food delivery orders while you're doing another order is if you get an order and you accept it while you're still delivering something else by the time you deliver whatever and you come back the, the food most likely is, you know is ready you know you're giving the order more time to be prepared so once you get there it's already complete well that's the hope let's check let's check this out all right so our order was nice and ready let's go deliver you see i love it when it's ready oh my goodness all right let's deliver it's for six dollars I'm afraid this is gonna spill while I'm recording. The order is nice and secure. The coffee is secure. The food is secure. The bag is secure. The money is secure. Let's go. Okay, the time is 9.17 in the morning and we just completed our $6 order for 3.4 miles. Um, I, I don't know how much we're at right now money-wise, but let's keep going. I think we're doing good. I think we're still in the 19 an hour range, but let's go. It is 9.26 a.m. and we just accepted a $11 order for six miles. Uber Eats, let's go. All right, we have our bag nice and secure. I put this on the side because, you know, just to hold the coffee a little bit during the transit. And let's close it up so it can stay, stay nice and warm because it's a six mile drive. So close it up and let's go. All right, the time is 9.54 in the morning and we just completed our $11 order for six miles. And I'm not gonna lie, that was far. That was further than I thought. I mean, it's, it is six miles, but that seemed far. All right, so we just accepted a Walmart order for 22 miles going, uh, yeah, it's going 22 miles for $45. And it's five, it's five orders. So let's see, let's see, uh, let's see how this works. Maybe this is video worthy, maybe this is not video worthy, who knows. But let's try this out and see how this works. $45. Okay, this is our first Walmart order. Wish us luck, wish me luck guys. First Walmart order, five, it's five orders, $45, 22 miles. That satisfies our 1.5 mile parameters, so. Let's see how this works. Hey, this is pretty cool. Esports Arena Home of Competitive Game. I'm right here waiting for the Walmart orders, but look at this, it's pretty cool. I wonder if this is in every Walmart. Nice. Look, these are our five orders. I'm here thinking this is an Instacart, five Instacart orders with a million things, but this is it. Order number one, order number two, order number three, order number four, and order number five. And that's it. So basically, it's pure driving, this order. Okay, the time is 10, 11 in the morning. We are going to start delivering these five orders for 22 miles. Let's see how long it takes us to deliver this. Five orders, and you already saw how little the orders were, how, how tiny it was, $44, $45 for 22 miles? And people don't do this? People don't do Walmart orders? What? I mean, these orders are no-brainers, guys. These are orders are no-brainers. These are $2 a mile, $2 a, a mile orders. Why don't people do these orders? Because it's a long drive? I mean, it's, it's better to do $44, a $44 order, you know, in one order, you know, five different times than do, you know, single food orders. Because I just picked it up right now. I just picked up one order and I'm going to deliver it to five houses. But I just had to go to one spot. Maybe, maybe I'm missing something here and it's going to be a disaster in the end. But I mean, if this goes all according to plan, then... I might as well just camp out here at Walmart all morning, Saturday and Sunday until lunchtime and then go do food deliveries. But let's see, let's see. Maybe I'm just speaking too soon and it's gonna be a disaster, but it's 10, it's 10, 13 right now. Let's see how long it takes us. All right, the first order is 6.7 miles away. So let's drive 6.7 miles. It says 10 minutes, but Miami is a congested area. Uh, it's oversaturated with humans. So it may take us longer than 10 minutes, but let's go. 
All right, the time is 10.29 in the morning, 10.30. So it's been 15 minutes and we just completed the first package. We just delivered the first package. The second package is 1.9 miles away. Let's go deliver. This is a weird residence, guys. It's like very tiny. I don't know where anything is. I'm looking for 9425. Um, it's pretty cool. But 9420, oh, okay. This is a very tiny little residence. Wow, this is cool. Imagine living here, it's nice and quiet, you know? Look at these houses, beautiful. All right. Is this, is this it? Yeah, this is it. All right, the time is 10.44 in the morning and we just delivered this one order. It was kind of confusing because I don't know where the entrance was, but we got it delivered. The next order is seven miles away. So uh, it's a seven mile delivery. Let's see how long it takes. If this thing ever opens, this gate. This gate needs to open. Open sesame, please. Please open. All right, these are three orders left. This is one and two. And I think the delivery here is this one right here, this big one. Let me see though. I, think I gotta see what the number is. E39, yeah, this is it. This is it right here. All right, the time is 11.06 and we just completed our third order. Uh, this next order is for 3.6 miles. So we're almost at one hour. Uh, I was hoping to do this in, in an hour so I could say that uh, we did $45 in one hour and have that in the title, uh, you know, of, of the video. So it could be, so a lot more people could click on it. But um, I don't clickbait, so I don't clickbait. Um, uh, but let's go deliver this one, 3.6 miles. All right, so our 20 mile order is, uh, is testing the limits of my battery. I have 25% left and I still have to go charge it, which is kind of like in the other side of where I'm at. Um, but I think we will make it guys, we will make it. Okay, the time is 11.17 and we just completed our second to last delivery for the Walmart order. Let's deliver the last one. The last one is 2.5 miles. Let's go. These are these new looking houses. Look how nice they look. Beautiful, beautiful. I'm gonna move in a house eventually because I'm gonna become a millionaire, remember? I'm gonna become a millionaire and, and that's it. Look, nice houses. Look at these houses. Beautiful, beautiful. You don't see that a lot here in the city. In the city of Miami, you see a lot of old houses. But this looks like a new neighborhood. I think it's here. Okay, the time is 11.24 a.m. And we just completed our final Walmart delivery. The total was $45. And if you see this picture here, I just noticed that that person only ordered a, like a, a little bottle of, 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 of carbonated water. Uh, I think it was the sparkling ice. I think that's what it was. So that person just ordered a sparkling ice. So after 20 miles, my last delivery was a sparkling ice and that's it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's end it here. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you for watching guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, today was a great breakfast shift. It was an amazing breakfast shift. We made in total, we made $91.40 in total, guys. $91.40 in four hours. We finished that last Walmart delivery, the last um, order of the Walmart. We finished at 11, at 11.30, and we started working at 7.30. So that's four hours of work. We made $91.40 in just that one Walmart order. We made $45 for an hour and a half of work. So we made $30 an hour just for that one delivery, just for that one delivery. But in total, we made on average $22 an hour. Let me confirm here. Yes, we made $22.85 an hour. Don't forget to smash that like button to help me blow up in the YouTube world. And if you like this video, just subscribe. But thank you for watching, guys. Have a great, great day. Have a great, great week. Have a great, great year. And have a great, great career. Oh, 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 oh,